Hi, I am Sarah. John Somi, better known as Somi, is a Dutch Canadian Korean singer and songwriter that debuted under the group IOI. This later disbanded, and some started her own solo career with the hit song Birthday. Since the beginning of her career, she was already pretty slim, and she quickly gained attention for her half Caucasian slash Korean looks. When she appeared in the survival show called 16, she didn't make it to the final group, however, she did create a huge fan base for her. Later, she joined another TV show called Produce 101. She got raised quickly to the top rankings, making her the favorite from the start. In the first few months that she joined Produce 101, she did look a bit slimmer than normal. In April was when someone produced 101, and they made a debut. In a TV program, it was said that she only used to eat one banana for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. It was extremely hard for her at first, but she got used to it the longer she did it. She lost about 10 pounds for kilograms in one week, which is a lot. She got results, so she kept doing it once in a while. As you can see, this diet plan is extremely. Only eating one banana isn't healthy at all, and you should never try this yourself. When IOI debuted with Dream Girls, Somi was looking at her thinnest ever when performing. Produce 101 was very open about what they did with the girls, diets, and frequent weigh-ins. Although she wasn't in the main spotlight, when it came to dieting, it still likely felt the pressure. Later on, when they came together, they said that it was extremely hard during the Produce 101 era. The tutors kept an eye on them. After a month, she gained her weight steadily back and looked healthy again. In August, they came back with another hit, Wadam and Somi lost some weight again, but it wasn't as bad as when she performed Dream Girls. She still had her abs, which most of the people assumed she was working out a lot. As you can see, the banana diet of eating one banana for breakfast, lunch, and dinner is extremely harsh, and the calorie intake is too low to stay energized throughout the day. During this time, her figure was a hot topic again, because many people think it was a crash diet again. For the rest of 2016, she maintained her weight, and in late 2017 IOI disbanded. In February, she joined the TV show Sister Slam Dunk. In June, she said in a magazine that she lost interest in a debut because she was probably enjoying her life, and a debut didn't felt it was a need. When Somi went on a hiatus, she gained a bit of weight, but she maintained it for a very long time. She looked healthy and beautiful as always. Almost a year passed by, and in late 2018, her contract with JYP ended. She decided to join YG's company, The Black Label, this was a huge topic, because YG is the competitor of JYP. YG announced that Somi would be going solo in 2019, and not debuting in a girl group anymore. This was when YG got into a huge scandal, which pushed Somi's debut a bit further than planned. The fans kept waiting on her debut, but it kept getting pushed back. In June 2019, she released her solo birthday, and it was a pretty big hit, it looked like she maintained her weight during this time, and she also looked healthy when performing. However, she did say that she's been trying to go on a diet, but didn't make it. In a vlog where Somi appeared, she said that she lost almost 22 pounds, 9.7 kilograms, during her solo performance. This is a lot of weight loss in a short amount of time, which is never recommended. If you want to lose weight, you should create a diet that fits your schedule and eating habits. In late 2020 she made a comeback, and it looked like she has maintained her weight. We hope that Somi keeps making music, and we're going to always support her no matter what happens. Somi came back with another hit taking over the charts. The song is called Dum Dum and has already more than 1 million views after releasing it for two hours. In the video clip, she looked healthier than ever, and she didn't look too thin. You can really see that she has worked very hard for this comeback, and it finally paid off. We should keep supporting her and stream the music video. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel to keep sharing. Hi.